Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Ritchie and I want to thank you for joining me again. What I'd like to do today is talk a little bit about glasses. Now I'm going to talk about a very specific aspect of what you should think about when you order some glasses. And bear with me here, if you will, because to bring this topic to light, pun intended, I want to talk a little bit first about light. And if we think back to our days in high school physics, we learned about light and everybody remembers the visible spectrum, visible light, the Roy G. Biv, which is red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. And if you look over here at this end, you've got ultraviolet rays. And at this end, you have infrared and radio waves and microwaves. But it's this end of the spectrum the higher energy end of the spectrum that I want to talk about. We are all familiar with the damage or potential damage that UV light can cause. That's why all sunglasses block UV light. But what about this higher end of the visible light spectrum? What we call the high end or high energy end of the visible spectrum. In reality, new research has shown that not only do we need to be concerned with UV light and the potential to cause macular degeneration, but we need to be concerned with this high end energy. And if we blow this up and magnify it a little bit, we've got the blue and the indigo and the violet, but it's this end here that we call the high energy violet, HEV. We have learned that exposure to HEV is very similar to exposure to UV radiation. The potential damage to the retina can lead to macular degeneration. So some people then said, well, let's just block the high end visible light, the blue end problem. It's easy to block it. We can do that. But that throws off the body's natural biorhythms. It throws off what we call the circadian rhythm and sleep is the first thing that is disturbed. People who blocked the blue end of the spectrum, blue, indigo, and violet, had sleep disruption. So this end of the spectrum is vital in telling our bodies when to wake up and when to go to sleep. So we can't block all of it. But what we have figured out how to do is to block this dangerous HEV component, the high energy violet, it still allows enough of the blue light to enter that sleep is not disturbed. And now some of you who are thinking are going to say, well, wait a minute, what's the big deal? This has never been an issue before. And my answer to you is, you are correct. It has never been an issue before. But Never before have we been inundated with devices like this or a device like this or the one that causes the most trouble, a device like this. All of these handheld devices and computer monitors kick out primarily blue light with increased intensity of the high energy violet. All of these LCD monitors are overloading us with blue light that we've never been exposed to before. And in particular, we've never been exposed to it with this frequency and intensity. Now I mentioned that it's the high end or high energy light that helps with our wake sleep cycle. That's right. So when was our exposure? It was primarily dusk and dawn. Now it's continuous and for some of us relentless. We are starting to see early changes in young people's retina consistent with 
UV damage that can lead to macular degeneration. And we think this is the primary reason. Phones, uh, personal devices like iPads, uh, and in particular computer monitors. So what do we do? Well, fortunately, we have some options that we can look at and some technology that we can now fall back on. Very often, people who spend a lot of time on a computer get a pair of computer glasses. And the computer glasses are geared towards that correct working distance. But this is something that everybody who spends a fair amount of time on any handheld device should think about. There's a new um, filtering uh, material that we can put into these lenses and it is called Preventia. Preventia is like getting a non-glare coating and a scratch resistant coating. It's a coating that we can put on to the lenses that blocks high energy violet rays, the rays up in this range that are the most potentially dangerous, the ones that come predominantly from handheld devices, computers, phones, iPads, Game Boys, you name it. Now, one thing you should know about this Preventia technology is that when you have lenses that have a Preventia coating on it, you will know it because when the light hits them just right, the lenses will have a little bit of a blue color to them. Now, think about this. That's how you know the filter is working and the coating is working because what's happening is the blue light, the high energy violet light, doesn't pass through, it bounces off. That's why you can see the blue tint. It's not a blue tint. That's the reflected blue light that can't get through the lens. So you know it's working. Now it doesn't block all the blue, just that high energy blue, so it also doesn't disrupt wake sleep cycles. So next time you come in and you're looking for a pair of glasses, if you spend a lot of time on the computer, if you have children, now keep in mind our kids are all getting various electronic devices in school. They will be spending hours, hours each day on these devices. This Preventia technology is well worth the investment.